Channel 5 begins now with breaking news. Two Cleveland police officers in the hospital tonight after an attempt to arrest someone turned into tur arrest someone turned into a struggle with shots fired. News Channel 5's Kristen Volk just talked to the police chief. So Kristen, how are the officers doing right now? Well, Chris, they are doing okay, thankfully. Cleveland police tell us that one officer has gunpowder uh, gunpowder burns to his face because the suspect fired his gun so close to the officer's head. The other officer has bumps and bruises to his body. This incident unfolded here tonight on Riddell Avenue when police say officers started to struggle with a man. Now, this is cell phone video of the situation taken by a neighbor. You see officers trying to restrain a man. That neighbor tells us this is video after the shot was fired. Cleveland police say this all started with a burglary about 10 blocks away early Earlier this evening, that burglar shot at the homeowner, who thankfully was not injured. Police were looking for a silver pickup truck involved in the crime and found it here on Riddell Avenue later. When police say officers approached the pickup, the passenger got out and would not comply with officers' demands to stay inside. That passenger then took out his gun. This really could have turned out uh, tragically uh, for this city and for this division. Uh, but they were uh, two highly trained officers. They did what they were supposed to do, and they get to go home to their families tonight. Both officers were treated at the Cleveland Clinic tonight for their minor injuries. The suspect was also taken to the hospital for shortness of breath. In Cleveland, I'm Kristen Volk, News Channel 5.